we do the clap thing? Oh. Great day to have a team practice today. I like that it's early in the week, right? I think that when you're a coach or when you're a leader, number one, you have to know what you're talking about. You have to study your craft, but you also have to use that knowledge to empower other people. No there you go, no middle. Good, there you go, T. Growing up, I come from a family of lawyers, so our dinner table conversations were either about somebody's case or about sports. It was a passion of mine, and my parents like sports, no doubt about it, but were so eager to, I think, fuel whatever my passions were. Hey, listen up. We're really good at giving effort in the drill, right? But we then have to take it one notch to be like, I'm not just playing the drill, I'm competing against who I'm against. My background in sports began as a, as a young kid. And when I got to college, that was the first time I had this epiphany that, oh my gosh, coaching, it's something you can do with your life. Genuine beginnings begin within us, even when they're brought to our attention by external opportunities. I had had this epiphany that I definitely wanted to coach. So I sent a letter to all you know, 306 Division I coaches. I got a decent number of letters back. Um, some were more personalized than others, but Tara had sent, I think they probably had a form letter for, hey, we don't have a position open at this time, but you know, we'll keep it on file. Well, she wrote a note at the bottom of it that said, Dear Lindsay, the women's game needs young people like you. Please stay with it. Let me know if I could ever help. And I, I want to say it was, gosh, less than, you know, like 10 to, like 10 years later that um, I, I was coaching against her, which is really unbelievable. Put your body on somebody, right? And seal. And we gotta look and get it to them when they're sealing, okay? Good. Come on, Otto, come on. Yep, curl, curl, there you go. Come on, Maya, Whoop, there you go. I got questions all the time of, do you wanna go back to the East Coast? Do you wanna go to this school, that school? And really for me, that was never a thing. It was just not something that I wanted to do. But if you had asked me, what else would I be doing besides coaching at Cal? It would have been something really different. And I started to get some inquiries from people I knew in the NBA. There you go, there you go. At one point, someone had reached out to me on behalf of uh, the GM for the Cavs and said, hey, you know, he'd really like to talk to you. And I thought it was gonna be another one of these philosophical kind of things, hey, I heard you're a good person to know, vice versa. And I was blown away when he essentially said, I followed your career, I know what you've done, would you wanna come to the Cavs? And I was like, oh my gosh. You know, there's an infrastructure to worry about things like marketing and other things. So essentially as an NBA coach, you're working on basketball, X's and O's, player development and relationships with the guys, like nothing else. From a leadership standpoint, you grow as a leader the more diversified situations that you're in. And so the life experience of the NBA has only served me well going forward. And one that I would have done for longer had not USC called. The more perfect you can make your reps, uh, then it all comes together um, at a higher level than we were before. I, I think to be a leader, you have to be authentic, right? So you can't study someone else and try to be them. But you can study other people. I, I do it all the time. I watch coaches and business leaders and just you glean information from that. But absolutely most importantly, I think, is caring about people as human beings. Nobody wants to be led by someone who doesn't care about them. And so I think those things really embody that leadership quality. And I think that's just a little bit of what I've learned and a little bit of, of what comes naturally. And I think that's when it makes the most sense when those things come together. Desi, what are we saying? SC on three, one, two, three. SC.